According to Tasna, the drones include new generations of Atlas and Abable drones, adding that the two models Abable 3 and Carer had been showcased previously. The UAV's unmanned aerial vehicles are to be used by the Air Force and Air Defense Units of Iran's conventional army, the report said. Iran has introduced these high-cost drones, while it has been complaining about the adverse impact of U.S. sanctions on its economy. Last week, General Khaimur Zadari, the commander of the ground force of the army, had said on the occasion of the Army Day that the new weapons are going to be issued to army units. As far as his own units at the ground force were concerned, Hadari said that the G3 rifle was going to be replaced with a type of MP5 weapon the Ministry of Defense has provided, and the T90 tanks will be introduced to the ground force's armored units. Another commander broke the news about new drones that can reach Israel, but did not elaborate on the type of the UAV, its fuel, guiding and navigation system and other specifications. The drones introduced in a ceremony in the presence of the Minister of Defense and Army commanders included Abable 3, Carer, Atlas, and NASA. This is how Tasnam described the aircraft. According to Western observers Islamic Republic sources often exaggerate the capabilities of its armament. Although Abable 3 was officially first delivered to the Iranian Armed Forces in November 2014, it has been part of the Iranian Army's arsenal since May 2010, when pictures of it were first published during a military exercise over the Persian Gulf simulating a reconnaissance mission to check out vessels sailing in the Gulf. Abable 3 was also observed in several other military exercises between 2010 and 2014. It can fly up to 8 hours and can transmit pictures to its base or to any other platform within a range of 250 km from its base. It is gasoline-fueled, has a composite body, and can fly up to an altitude of 15,000 feet. According to Tasnam, this drone has been in use at the resistance front which could mean Iraq, Syria, southern Lebanon, Yemen and possibly elsewhere. Initially a reconnaissance UAV with two revolving cameras, Abable 3 is now mounted with Geem bombs to convert it into a combat flyer. The is the first Iranian-made drone flying with a turbojet engine. Carer was first showcased in 2010. It carries 500 kg of fuel, has a range of 1,000 km, and can fly with a speed of up to 900 km per hour. Carer can reschedule its flight mid-air and also can shut off enemy jamming devices. Carer has been used in reconnaissance and interception missions and boasts a very efficient navigation system. Depending on the mission it can fly in an altitude between 25,000 to 40,000 feet. It can fire anti-vessel Coaster cruise missiles to target vessels within 25 kilometers. Atlas is an upgraded version of Abable 3 and one of the new models that were displayed on Sunday. Its main structure is similar to Abable 3, but improvements have been made in some of its functions including its landing mechanism. The front wheel has a hydraulic system and improvements have been made in the rear wheels and axis to make takeoff and landing smoother. Atlas can carry Geem bombs and its wings and body have been fortified to make it capable of carrying at least two bombs.
However, the biggest advantage of Atlas to older models is its auto takeoff and landing system, and a laser sensor underneath the body which makes it more agile and capable of landing and taking off without help from a pilot. With this system, the UAV can change the landing area if the situation in the pre-planned area is not ideal for landing. Thank you.